Hey, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Fight Night Champion. This is my legacy boxer, Orion Snyder. This is fight number 39 of my legacy career, which is career mode. This is our second time taking on Tommy Morrison. Last time we knocked him out, um, I thought, you know, since I switched weight classes, and it's a sim so we're going to be in similar weight, uh, he's going to have a weight advantage over me. Maybe he would put up a better fight. So we'll see. We're going to come out swinging hard on him, making sure we're targeting his head and his body, mixing it up, going back and forth. We have si very similar fighting styles. We're both sluggers. We're both not really boxing. We're just hitting each other as hard as we can. We are underway here, and we've heard from everybody that speed is going to be the big factor. Snyder's got it. Plenty of it. Yeah, now it's up to his opponent to come up with something. Maybe go to the body, take it away, slow him down. To the head he goes with a left hand. Left to the body. Talked about this time and time again. When you get these two mentalities squaring off against each other, it should be a brawl. Yeah, the old timers would say about these guys, they get insulted if you miss them. The Galaxy Warriors well off the mark that time. Good right hand. He clearly came in with a strategy here tonight, Teddy, and so many times it's, hey, I'm going to bang that drum. Yeah, he is banging that drum. That drum happens to be the body. And he figures that he's going to try to move on him. So start doing it early on. And later on, he's going to have a guy in front of him. In and out, in and out. The way these two are going at it early on, they're going to break the punch stat computer. Well, they're trying to break more than that. They're trying to break each other's will. Commits to the straight right. And after the end of the first round, it seems pretty even. He's done a lot more damage to me than I've done to him. You can see that cut under my right eye. Um, it's pretty bad. He's done 76% damage to, compared to my 19%. We're pretty even in stamina, though. So, going forward, I feel like I should be able to knock him out. Just got to avoid him knocking me out. This could be my first loss. We'll see how round two goes. Just the way he finished up last round. Yeah, what I like is that he's a thinking man fighter, and his corner gave him probably good advice. They know that the opponent only had 60 seconds to recover, and they're figuring it wasn't enough time. Accurate shot, straight right hand comes in. Right to the belt line. Galaxy Warriors starting to score at ease against his opponent there. Anytime you can land a three-punch combination, you're really hitting your groove. Morrison smashed by an uppercut. A stinging uppercut by the Galaxy Warrior. Morrison's banged by an uppercut. Tommy Morrison. Oh! And down goes Morrison. My combination of targeting his head and his body and his head has paid off. He is down on the mat. Looks like he should be able to beat the count and get up. Yep, he's up, so the fight continues. One punch and he's already stunned. Let's see if we can send him back to the mat. There he goes, right back on his back, falling backwards after a straight right to the forehead. Coming down right above his left eye. This time he is not going to beat the count, and the fight is over. We improved to 39-0 and 0 with 38 knockouts. This is our second time beating Tommy Morrison. Tommy the Gun didn't have the knockout power that I thought he would. He did have enough power to split my face wide open, 
and get blood all over my chest. But that's going to be it for that fight. I hope you enjoyed it. We're going to take a quick look at our stats and see how we did punch for punch against Tommy Morrison. Now, we both completed 70%, so that's that. If you enjoyed this fight, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.